Hi everyone and welcome to today's session where we're going to demonstrate and explain a little bit about the lunge. The lunge is a whole body workout but predominantly associated with leg days. Utilises most of the upper leg, so uh, in particular the thigh and the glutes. Uh, obviously the hamstring and the quad comes under that. <clears throat> and utilises balance and coordination as well. So all round quite a good workout. There's a few different ways to do it and it's basically just kneeling with one knee and um, Dean's going to walk forward between the cones and just demonstrate the general lunge. Okay so a backward lunge there as well. We're looking for a nice high torso, nice neutral spine and we're looking for the knee to come under control towards the ground. 90 degree bends wherever possible almost in a military fashion. If you don't have a lot of space, this is an exercise that can be done in one location. So standing still, we're just going to lunge forward, stand, swap legs and lunge again. And if you want to increase and make this a little bit harder, this can be done in two ways. We're going to pick up a weighted bag and just increase the weight that's utilised. Okay, so going back into the lunge with the additional weight. At the minute, Dean's got this across his shoulders, balanced onto his back. We can also hold this into the chest slightly as well. If you don't have additional weight, but you want to make the exercise a little bit more difficult, a little bit more challenging, we can do that without the weight by making this almost plyometric. So we're going to go down into the lunge and then explode up. Get down into the lunge and explode up. We'll change that a little bit. So if we come down into the lunge and then I uh, just swap round. Does it go again? Okay, so we can make this a little bit more challenging by lunging down and exploding back up and changing legs. So we're gonna go down and explode up. This will increase the heart rate and the lung work quite quickly. Um, so I wouldn't expect this to be sustained over a long period of time. Quite good as part of a HIT workout. Okay, if we just go back to water lunges. So if we just pick out a couple of metres of space in whatever area you've got, or standing static lunges, so just one at a time in a standing position. And if you lunge along with Dean, I'm just going to give you a little fun fact there. So for this one, I'm going to tell you a little bit about water and hydration. So vitally important to not just our health, but our immune system um, as well. In general, what I advise to be drinking two litres of water a day. Now this can include a limited amount of tea and coffee. Okay. Again, it's vitally important for well-being, especially if you've got mental health issues. A little bit of a tip is if you can grab a bottle or a cup and keep it with you majority of the day. You don't have to be drinking cups or bottles at a time, just sip away throughout the day. Um, if you're like me, um, it's a little bit easier to have slightly larger amounts at intervals throughout the day. So there isn't a right or a wrong way to do it. Um, just try to stay hydrated. You'll tend to find that this will help lift your mood um, and also help either combat or prevent any kind of head heaviness or, or potential headaches as well. So just try to take that on board and incorporate this into what's potentially going to be your healthier lifestyle. Dean, thanks very much.